guys, it is a very foggy morning this morning in Orange Beach, Alabama. I'm gonna go down to Alabama Point East Public Beach Access and give you a little tour around there to show you the beach accesses. There's three different boardwalks, a bathhouse, and take a little stroll around Alabama Point. Thank you for watching the videos. Thank you for subscribing. And here we go. Hopefully this fog will start to burn off a little bit by the time we do the walk around Alabama Point itself so you can actually see how pretty it is out there. But there is parking here at Alabama Point East, public beach access underneath the bridge, paid parking here. There is Cobalt Restaurant over there. There is a small little paved parking lot here near the bathhouse and picnic areas. It is also paid to park, just like at all of the Gulf State Park public beach accesses. There are some covered picnic areas here and three access points. I'll take you down each one of these in just a few minutes. This one is just a sand path that takes you out to the Gulf side. They do have showers to rinse off with. little covered picnic area. This little boardwalk area out to the beach. We'll take a path down each of these. This longer one here goes out to the Gulf side. And this is a shorter one that goes over to the pass itself. Bathrooms. And showers that you can rinse off with. Keep in mind the currents on the pass side can be quite strong at times. It's $3 for two hours, $5 for four hours, or $10 for all day. Cash, credit, debit cards accepted, but the machines do not dispense cash, or change rather.
This is the end of the longest boardwalk access here at Alabama Point East. This one takes you nearly to the point itself. Over in this area over here, if you can see through the fog, is the pass. And straight over there is the gulf. You can start to see the Perdido Pass Bridge coming through the fog now. And there's the pass. Fog slowly burning off. There's the pass. The first shortest little boardwalk is down there and goes over behind where that little lifeguard stand is. And the sand path starts over here and comes over to the boardwalk and then goes up and over to more of the gulf side. Now with the fog burning off, you can really see the shorter boardwalk that goes right over to the pass. And where they connect down there. I'm on the second boardwalk that goes out more towards the point itself. You see the little bath areas and picnic areas. And the sand path that turns into a boardwalk on out that goes to the gulf. Beach access farthest to the east, the one that starts with the sand path, is arguably the toughest one because the sand is soft. And it's quite a ways before you get to the boardwalk itself, but it does take you straight out to the gulf side. In addition to it being illegal to enter the dune systems, this little area is roped off because it is a bird nesting season. If you continue to look on down to the east there, in the far distance you can barely see a lifeguard stand. That will be at the Shell Lot public beach access. But we are going back around the point today back around underneath the pass into the bridge. That is where the sand path exits onto the beach. And as you can see, it takes you right here, Gulf Front. At Alabama Point East. Still a hazy, foggy day. There is the end of the middle boardwalk that takes you more here to the point.
wooden board walk out to the point down near where that lifeguard station is down closer towards the bridge is where the short one comes out and this is Perdido Pass Here is the end of the shortest little wooden boardwalk out to the pass. As you see, it runs parallel to the bridge and comes right here on the pass itself. And that's a quick little look around Alabama Point East public beach access on this hazy, foggy day. Thank you for watching the videos and thank you for subscribing.